Pia loves it when I start the vlog at 6.15 a.m. Are you excited, Pia? For what, my dad? Tomorrow! Yes. I'm excited already. We are tidying up the house and then we're gonna go to the gym and then we've got to run errands and do all sorts of stuff because we're going to Fiji in the morning. But before we go, we have a bunch of errands and packing and I still have to take a couple of photos today. So we have one of the busiest days oh. I can possibly imagine. Yeah. Record a full podcast, take a photo for a client and post something for Vlogmas today. And upload the podcast. And get my nails done. So babe, you know we leave for Fiji in 27 hours. Oh, that's insane. I feel like I should have gone to the gym a lot more. I feel like I should have done my hair. <laughs> Just standing back here. Uh. <laughs> right, I'm gonna put this away because we do actually need to tidy the house and then get to the gym, so uh, yeah. You're kind of wobbly like a mouse right now. You've got it good. Look at those. <laughs> I thought you were going to carry on. What's this workout called, Pia? Which one? The one where you're just sitting still doing nothing. Just chilling. All right, gym session is done. Uh, I got to head home real quick and try and walk the dog before Christina arrives. And then we've got a full day of work, so it's going to be a crazy day. I don't know how we're going to do it but we're gonna try it. I'm not sure what's going on here, but I don't think it's meant to do that. How are you doing, Pia? Good, good, how are you? Good. Quick update. We leave. Yeah, I'm stressing. <laughs> These updates are not helping. I was just about to tell you how many hours we go. <sighs> yeah, stressing. So, I still have to shoot something today, which yep. is why I'm getting ready real quick. So you and me need to run and shoot. You need to edit the video that we shot yesterday. Yep. Then we also need to record the podcast. Yep. I need to go shopping for all the things I need. I need to get my hair done and my nails done and pack. Do you reckon you can get that all done? No. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm gonna leave PRB then because she's super busy. I think I should edit some videos. <laughs> summer trip like all season for some reason we like didn't do any summery trips in the last six months or so and everywhere I've gone has been like wintry and everything so I am in desperate need for like some cute beachy clothes so that's the first thing I need to go and find I'm struggling a little bit to find like beachy clothing like I keep going to all the usual places that I go and they're pretty much all like dressy like event clothes and I want like linen basically so I'm gonna go like to some surf shops and stuff like that. Okay this hasn't been super successful yet. I found one top that I really like from Age and I got that but it's not really beachy I just feel like it would look cool for a photo like wearing it with kind of like high waist bikini bottoms but it's not really what I'm supposed to be getting while I'm here so I always find it so much easier to shop online because you can kind of just sit there and like look at everything in one go and I can never be bothered to try things on so I'm kind of running around uh, a little bit lost at the moment but I'll show you guys what I got when I get home oh. Pia has wrote me into running some errands with her yes we are go, go, go today. I've just been shopping. It was very unsuccessful, unfortunately. But now we have to go and see Agent Grace real quick. Agent Grace. I love this thing. Parks by itself. It does quite a good job now. For a while there, it was garbage. For a while there, it would go in like diagonally and then just not be able to do it. And it would just go, abort. <laughs> so you'd be stuck like halfway oh, no. in a car park with no way to get in or out. So bad, but it did it, it did it fine. So that's nice. good. The air quality in Sydney is currently as bad as smoking 36 cigarettes. Just by being outside. Oh, oh it's no wonder I've got a sore throat. 
It's quite worrying, really. Yeah, very. It's not getting better. No. I'm seeing so many people in the city walking around with masks on. Yep, I saw that too. I saw in the paper today that a lot of Canadian firefighters are flying over from Canada, cancelling their holidays, and coming to help our firefighters because it's getting so bad. <laughs> hmm. I don't know if we can get to our families for the holidays because um, we would be driving through the bushfire area, so yeah. I guess we just have to wait and see. Alright, <laughs> package is picked up. <laughs> just an average size Christmas stuff. That's what <laughs> Is that actually got makeup in it? Yeah, it's full to the brim. Meanwhile, over here. Oh, are you still feeling upset, Muesli? Muesli's tummy hurts, doesn't it, little one? She's got a rash on her tummy, so she's on antibiotics, and I don't think she's she's feeling sorry for it. Oh, are you feeling sorry for yourself? Are you feeling sorry for yourself, Moo Moo? Okay, you carry on resting, okay? We'll come check on you later. You know that we're only going away for five days. Yeah, but I need options. <laughs> <laughs> that is a lot of clothing, Pia. No, it's 23 kilos. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> is that what you've weighed it out to be? <laughs> just max out your suitcase? I think so. I think so. I just want to show you guys what I got today. This was the top I was talking about. Oh, that's cool. How cool is it? Wait, is that a top or just a... It's a top. It's like this big, puffy top. Oh, that's nice. And you put your arms... There's an armhole down there, so you can either wear it like up one shoulder or just across like that. And the reason I thought I would bring it is because I think it will look really cool. Picture this in a photo with like bikini bottoms. The other stuff that I'm bringing, this is all swimsuits, bikinis. These, this one's Zimmerman. I've got a couple from Zimmerman because I really like them. They're like really cool and structured and frilly. So um, I got this one today as well. Ooh. Which I think this could be quite cute on the beach because you can just wear like shorts or a sarong or something I with it. I think that'll be nice. That'll be nice next to palm trees. Yeah, right. Once I have a tan. <laughs> when, when Again, we're only going for five days. <laughs> I'm I'm planning for a big holiday here. Um, then what I do have is these are the kind of bottoms that I like to bring on holiday in a beach vacation. Is like these kind of yeah. things little like linen-y skirts because they're so versatile you can wear them with like a blouse or just like a bikini top or something and they just kind of like fit the vibe of a beach holiday and then over here so that i don't know that's just giving me such like there's need like a little straw basket and some sunflowers <laughs> yeah that's really cute <laughs> such a cute little dress so i've got this in a couple of different colors and that's pretty much it then what I like to do is lay out all of my jewellery, which I will then end up putting in one bag. But I like to kind of take photos of what I've got before I pack. So as I pack this, I'm going to quickly take a snap of everything that I put in there so that when I have to figure out what to wear, I can just kind of flick through my photos on my iPhone rather than having to like rummage through my entire suitcase. That's actually pretty smart. It's very clever. Yeah, that's what these are, babe. These are like eye cool patches. That you just <laughs> put them in the fridge and then in the morning, if you're feeling a little bit hungover or something, you just pop these on your eyes. Brilliant. I'll do it for you. Thanks, thanks. <laughs> this is like the straw beach hat. This is kind of like to make one of those little summer dresses look a bit cooler. Oh my goodness. And this one, I just love it. Great. Okay. Well, congratulations on exceeding the weight allowance of a flight. <laughs> um, shall we end this vlog now? Yeah, we should. Okay, so we need to get packing and desperately need to get a little bit of sleep. So we'll sign off the vlog now. Yep. But yesterday in our live upload, we did a giveaway for a $100 Amazon voucher. And the winner of that is... Drum roll, please. Emily Burton. That's because Pia wants to try out Dungeons and Dragons. That's why she, she chose Emily's comment. <laughs> yeah, I do. It's not even for me, it's she, actually for Pia. She spoke to the nerd in me. <laughs> <laughs> And we are going to do the same giveaway today. So if you would like to win a $100 Amazon voucher, comment below what your dream destination to travel to is. Ooh. And no, we're not giving away that dream destination in tomorrow's vlog. No, just $100. Just $100. <laughs> <laughs>